What's up, guys? Rob from Major Bunny's Gaming here, bringing you another episode of Rhythm Doctor in the new ward from the new update with our a baseball plant patient here. I'm a little tired. I uh, just got back from a family dinner for the holiday season, so uh, yeah, just uh, this will be interesting seeing if I can keep rhythm in time while I am a little bit, you know, I had a lot to eat. You know, you get a little tired after a big meal. We'll see, uh, see how this goes. <laughs> Patient is experiencing harsh muscle pain. We should administer a pain reliever right away. Well, fucking do it then. <coughs> I don't see why we would wait. Hi, right, before we start, he wanted to share something. Hey, intern, remember that time you treated that miner on the train? It got me thinking. He was in a lot of pain, but there wasn't much we could do before you finished treatment. I decided to work on a way that we could use rhythm defibrillation as pain reliever, and it works. Oh boy. Now you'll be able to administer pain reliever to any patients who are experiencing muscle inflammation, nerve damage, etc. It can sort of freeze the pain receptors, which should soothe them. As a new cue, listen closely. I'll show you how it's done. Ready, get, set, go. That's the cue. Oh, that's oh no. Get set go. Stop. That's fucking brutal. You just oh my god. There's a slight delay when the bee freezes. It's only for them for a short moment to so pay attention and hit it right after it thaws. Why? 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 That's, you have made my life way worse, Ian. Thank you for nothing. The delay of the beat can change. Listen to the cue rhythm when a patient freezes. It's the exact same length as the beat's delay. What? This fucking sucks. Ian, you have fucked me. I can't. Ah! This is. F oh my god! That is so. Oh my. This is actually so annoying. Why would you do this to me? Uh, yeah, okay. I I got it. I don't got it, but I got it. Oh my god. Why? Finally some fresh air. Get set. Go.
Hey, it's really working. My shoulder, my elbow, it doesn't hurt. Set. Go. that last one few just gotta catch my breath if I can get back in shape that'll show coach that I'm the real deal hey where is lucky he ran outside the freeze beats numbed his shoulder again the exhaustion is about to start setting in I hope the intern is good at counting and fu fuck you Ian What is? Can I please get a screen that's not like freaking out? B plus. I f f disagree with that assessment. Hey, what's that stuff you blast me with? I feel worse than before somehow. I'm so sorry, sir. You must have overexerted yourself. The freeze beat stalled your pain, so your body thought it was safe to be active again. And like all pain relievers, they wore off. I know it's hard, but we need to take it slow. Slow. Slow? This is already taking forever. Ah! You have to cry about it. I don't have time for this. Have you checked your phone lately? Mad Dog Mike, Sports of the Round Table. I'm getting roasted. No, what is a Mad Dog Mike? These people with their talk shows and podcasts, they're vultures. They'll say anything to paint me as some sort of cocky idiot. And my coach is stupid too. He'll actually listen to these armchair experts and the no life trolls and do what they say. Last week, everyone had to admit that I was a pillar of the team, an MVP, but now, as soon as I'm out of the game, I'm some dusty old nobody. Tch, whatever. You wouldn't get it. Shiny little med school goody two-shoes. Bet you're a smart little rich kid and everyone loves you. Yo, you need to fucking chill, dog. They respect you. They listen to you. Can you imagine how it would feel? You have one bad day on the field and then the world just chews you up and spits you out? Useless, outdated, after everything you did for them. I, well, never mind. Just leave me alone. I'll do what you said. Go to another hospital. Maybe they'll see it my way. That won't be necessary. Oh, Dr. Adiga. Mr. John Ranero, I understand your frustration. I completely agree. Rotator cuff surgery is a lengthy process. It's not at all appropriate to fit your busy schedule. Dr. Page must have misspoke. You're welcome to try another hospital, but if speed is your priority, I highly recommend staying at Middle C. This is the only facility with access to truly modern technology. What? You've got some kind of secret weapon? I understand you were dissatisfied with our intern's use of the pain reliever, but you misunderstood. The freeze beats are only a prototype. Huh? I'll have Ian get started immediately on developing the new rhythm treatment. One that can mend damaged muscles and nerves permanently. I leave you to your decision. If you feel that months of physical therapy is more your speed, you're welcome to try that instead. What was that? New rhythm treatment. Um, intern, can you keep watch? I need to go check on something with Ian. Is that Toad? Like, huh? The patient that Haley met on a train has been admitted. He's currently using this room for daily stretches. Oh, the miner. Interesting. Uh, who are you supposed to be? 
howdy. Sorry, am I in your way? I thought this was like the fitness room. I had a bit of a scare the other day with some chest pain, so I've been trying to be a little bit more cautious about my health. Nobody of mine used to tell me you've only got one body. You better treat it right. I should have listened. And after getting a little spooked on a train ride, I figured I could at least give the hospital a visit. How about you? What are you in for? Oh, uh, something about a rotator cuff. Can't use my arm. Now I'm stuck here. It sucks. Hmm. How about we do a workout together? That friend I mentioned showed me all kinds of stretches, but before that, I want to feel the difference in strength between your two shoulders. Let's try something. Hold your arm out and give me a big thumbs up. <laughs> Ayy, hitting with the fans. Good. Now flip it to a thumbs down if you're tired of me already. I'm going to gently cut my hands around yours. You feel a slight push from me, but try slowly moving your arm up and down. Whoops. Okay. that's enough now we'll do the real thing relax and let your mind wander you might hear people from outside it's perfectly fine just clear your mind feel the rhythm and do the reps at your own pace what Can't read, I'm focusing. One of the biggest names on a team. If that's so true, then how come nobody's reached out? No phone calls from coach, no visits from my teammates. No flowers to get well student cards. All I got was a couple pieces of fan mail. At least someone remembered me. What's the point of all this again? Just a little test. And yep, looks like that shoulder got real weak. If it's so weak, why don't I just work out, pump it back into shape? Ha, huh? if you try to lift weights, your body will topple like a stack of twigs. You need some gentle tension. Oh, hold on a tick. I've got some bungee cord in my bag. This will be perfect. Now grab the cord. Slowly pull it inward without turning your body. Fucking samurai. I wasn't expecting everyone here to be so chatty. Why not? I don't know. Every hospital visit I've ever had was all business. Get in, get out, no small talk, no life story. Are we going to get patched up so you get back out to work? Anyway. I know you're trying to help, but I still don't really feel anything. Exactly. It doesn't hurt, right? Uh, no. Then you're doing swell. Alright, I did your workout. Now what? Now rest up for a second, then we do it again. Again? Yep. The point isn't for it to be difficult. It's for you to do over and over again, like a routine. And then I'll be back to peak performance. I can't promise that, but if you keep at it, you'll get your movement back eventually. Let's do another set. This will be your cooldown, so let's do them slower. Hold the stretch for three beats for each rep instead of one. This one's weird. Damn it.
with you. Good workout. I think we'll stop for the day. Are you sure? That was short. No need to push yourselves one day at a time. Great work today. F. Fuck you. Okay, wow. Good job. I doubt it. What do you think? Was that too much? Somehow I feel fine. I mean, my show's so busted like hell, but nothing we did was hurting it. Great, it was a good thing we took it slow. We can do it again tomorrow. Same time. As long as we don't push your body past when it's ready to handle, it shouldn't hurt. Thanks. Yeah. I'm sure you didn't think you woke up today that you'd be helping lucky John Ranero with stretches, huh? Huh, sorry, should I know you? Oh. I play for the Middle Sea Scales, play baseball, I mean. Or at least I used to before all of this. Well, welcome. I'm glad I was able to meet another friendly face. I guess you can call me the lucky one. I also met a girl today named Haley. She recommended I come here. She seemed like a ray of sunshine, too. Since I'm here, I might as well make the most fit and meet everyone. Next time you, you want to talk workouts, you know where to find me. Have a good one, Lucky. Oh, uh, sure. Oh, this is the boss stage. Um, alright, I guess we'll do that in this video. I was about to end the video, but if it's already at the boss, then I'll put it in this video. Might have to cut if I keep failing. We'll see. Patient hasn't accepted Dr. Duke's office procedure yet. He's been seen doing physical therapy once a day. This may need to be edited. Hello? Dr. Page was supposed to be here to assist you, but she seemed to be running late, getting distracted by the patients, presumably. Point of two, there's a few things you need to be prepared for. Rage. Anger. You've done an excellent job so far regulating Mr. Domino's heartbeat during this difficult time. It's still behaving erratically, so there's a few new patterns to be prepared for. According to Ian's notes, the first exercise will be called the Blast Beat. That was the get set cues you learned back in SVT ward, but it's a bit off time from how it usually goes. Watch this demonstration. Ready, get, set, go. Ready, ready, get, set, go. Get, set, go. Oh, this is going to be a mess. As you can hear, there's an extra whistle cue from the nurse to signal a type of beat. The patient's heartbeats are always unpredictable. If someone's going to need to master the fibrillation system, you'd be ready for anything. Trying to miss any beats, even if that quick transition catch you off guard. Oh boy. Good enough. There's another pattern you should brush up on. His heart is subdivided strangely and sometimes it beats in quick chunks. I've told the nurse to warn you with a cue from when the spirit stretch out one. Oh boy. What the fuck? What? Okay. What are we doing here? Okay, we're... This is actually getting ridiculous now. Oh, we're minimized again. Ah, very nice. Ready, get, set, go! And another one of these, huh? And... Another boss stage which is gonna fly all over my screen.
What the fuck? What the fuck is happening with this? Like, what is going on? Oh my god. This is ridiculous, man. Ready, get set, go! This is, okay, this is actually really annoying. Yeah, okay. This is really, really annoying. Because I feel like this isn't about the rhythm. This is about just throwing shit at you until you beat it. And I thought this was done well the first time, but holy crap is that annoying. I'm going to just cut to when I beat this. I'm not going to make you sit through all these attempts because this is going to take me a while. And Jesus Christ, why? <laughs> Good Lord. Ready, get set, go. Jesus, did we do it? I'd be a lot more inclined to uh, feel bad about this story, Lucky, if your boss fight wasn't so annoying. This guy's trauma dumping in chat, bro. Ready, get, set, go. That wasn't the end. Absolute cocksucker. Oh, you motherfuckers.
Fuck! Oh my god. scream it's not thursday but i want to scream yeah whatever i don't give a fuck What in the motherfuck, dude? Please let it be over. God. <laughs> yes, it would be easier to let it be over, Lucky. Jesus. Oh my lordy lordy loo. That took way too long. <laughs> How are you feeling today, Mr. John Ranero? I'm feeling bad. No, I'm feeling bad. Just taking it one day at a time. Your shoulder doesn't hurt so much anymore. Excellent, glad to hear it. Oh, and hey, congrats on your team's win. The hospital team, I mean. I can't believe you were able to whip them all into shape so fast. Ha, huh, well, I was surprised to see they had it in them. Ah, there you are, Mr. John Ranero. Good news, Ian has completed a beta build of the new defibrillator. 
If we perform the procedure today, you can be back in Pro League by tomorrow morning. No recovery period. Wow. Wait, really? Tomorrow? Of course. Then time for the playoffs. Ready? Actually, I think I'll pass. Excuse me? I couldn't tell at first, but it looks like I've been making good progress on my own. Even if it's taking forever. When I got here, I was dying to get out, but maybe this place ain't so bad. People are nice and persistent. And I'm guessing you have really good insurance for you to be saying all this. I thought they were screwing around when they said they wanted to play ball, but they really went through with it. And every point they scored, it felt just as good as scoring my own. Maybe even better. I spent my whole career trying to make miracles happen on pure grit and determination. But after seeing how pumped they were winning just one little game, maybe all that energy I built up is better spent somewhere else. If your beta build thingy goes wrong, I might lose this part of me that's still left. I can't do that. I've only got one body, you know? Interesting. The choice is your own, but if I may... From what I can tell, the status of your next contract with the middle sea scale seems to be hanging by a thread. You're keeping your fans waiting, and your team. I can't imagine that reflects well on you. Yo, you're a fucking bitch, Adiga. Well, maybe I found a better team. Thanks for the offer anyway, Doc. Good luck with your beta testing. Get wrecked, you idiot. Enjoy the rest of your stay. I'm sure Dr. Page must know what's best for you. Yeah, I hope you fall down a cliff, Adiga. Hey, uh, Ada, we should talk. What's up? About that virus. Connectifia abortus. The interns working at the baseball game handling the big flare-up gave me a lot of great info. I think I figured it out. It's the rhythm defibrillation system itself that keeps causing the glitches. Oh, that's not good. Yeah, yikes, right? There's good news. I think we can fix it. I just need more time. Adiga keeps dragging me away to work on his new miracle cure thing. If you and the intern keep him busy and take care of all the patients, I can figure out how to get rid of the virus. It's good. Yeah. Although maybe a little bit easier said than done. Definitely, but the intern's been unstoppable. So, well, I've been very stoppable. Let's let's not be silly here. I've been very stoppable. So yeah, they'll keep things running as smooth as... Oh, hey, Doc. Since I'm going to be stuck here anyway, I'm still feeling the post-victory glow. I want to get something off my chest. You two aren't so bad, maybe. I mean, you do spew a bunch of techno jargon at me and keep me cooped up in bed all the time. And... Uh, make me eat yogurt and vegetable mush. But at the end of the day, I know you're just trying to help. Sorry if I gave you a rough time or something. Not at all. We're just here to do right by you, no matter what. Even on the days when being here isn't so fun. Well, from now on, I'll try not to make your life a living hell. I promise. And as for you, intern, once I finish my recovery, uh, you're gonna kick my ass? I'm challenging you to an arm wrestle. Yeah, you're gonna kick my ass. So you better not transfer any other clinics, you hear? The intern is gonna break this man like a- What? I- No? Do you know who I am? Making friends over here, coach? I knew you had it in ya. Loving that hustle, coach. The charm. The can-do attitude. Aw, coach. If you just want to make friends, you should just ask. We'll be your friends. Oh. Jesus. Yeah, rest up real good because you're all jogging laps around the block tomorrow. Does he mean us too? I think so. Come on, intern. Let's hustle. There's still a lot of work to do. You ready? No, not particularly. Boop. Is this another credit scene? Wait. I think I did this already. No, I can't skip this. Okay. I guess this is just a thing now. I'm pretty sure that I did this already.
Oh my god. Maybe this is different. This song seems familiar. I don't remember this like all the backer stuff though. Interesting. Okay, I guess that is new. So I guess this is like the chapter five ending until chapter. Thank you for everything. Yeah, so I'm guessing yeah that was the ending of chapter five which means of course there's going to be chapter six at some point i'm assuming since the story is not quite done yet um so of course when that does release i will play that for you guys but that's gonna have to do it for now that was an interesting chapter i i gotta admit i'm not the biggest fan of the freeze beats that is quite frustrating to, to deal with because of the it's like the whole thing just you know that's the point is that it's supposed to be annoying because it throws off your rhythm but yeah it's a uh, it's a little bit frustrating but oh well that's just what you're gonna you're gonna get sometimes so hope you guys enjoyed i will see you guys again next time